Okay guys, welcome to Truck and Coffee. Guys, today we're here with a 2013 International with a Max Force 13 engine. You can see the stop engine light is on. So what happened, um, I was driving the truck. My DPF lights start flashing, the horn start going off. I pulled over. I tried to do a manual region and it wouldn't take it. And as you can see also my ABS lights is on too. So This is the Nexus NL102P and that's what I'm going to be using today to force a region on this Max Force. So the first step is to turn on the truck and get get it warmed up. You need at least 158 160 degree temperature before you could do a force region. So once it warms up to temperature We'll go back in the computer and see if they will do a force region. Hey guys, so just warmed up the truck to about 168 degrees. And you see how my stop engine light just shut off by itself. Region button is working. guys it's about 16,000 rpm temperature right now is at 170 region light is on so the system is doing the region my ABS lights are still on and it's giving me an electrical fault I believe I have a bad sensor, but first I'm gonna deal with the region, then I'll deal with the ABS. So now we're just gonna wait and let it complete the region. You see the temperature's rising. So let's continue to wait and see how it goes. Okay guys, right now it's been a little bit over 15 minutes the region is still going on temperatures are out 200 degrees let's keep on waiting we'll go from there okay guys so right now the region just finished 
been about an hour. You can see the RPM drop. Temperatures dropping. Stop engine light is off. now RPM is about 600 RPM region not needed so this is the live data so right now it's telling me region was completed it doesn't need any anything else done to it and as I'm switching it's telling me different temperatures from Temperatures dropping back to 173. So overall, guys, what I recommend it, yes, under $200, Force Region on a 2013 International Max Force 13 motor. Alright guys, there we have it. Any questions? Drop any comments and I'll do my best to answer them. Like always guys, thank you so much for watching. Drive safe and I'll catch you guys in the next one.